My name is Rip Hemingway, and I'm from Olympia, Washington. I do a lot of running. I used to play a lot of soccer, uh, backcountry skiing, and whitewater kayaking. Those are the things that put smiles on my face. You know, I, I started losing mobility. Like, I couldn't stretch at all. Everything was really tight, and going up and down stairs hurt. When you have chronic pain, it means that you can't focus on other things in life. So, you know, your kids or your work or anything outside of work, it's really hard to feel like you can take on life in a positive way. It's a pretty, it's a pretty debilitating thing. After I was complaining to the point where my wife Jocelyn said, you need to either deal with this or shut up. <laughs> so I felt frustrated because every time I would go in and see a specialist, they would give me a list of different things that they think it might be, and, uh, but never any kind of concrete uh, clarity around what the problem was. So, um, unfortunately, typically when they tell me things that they, they think it could be, it meant going to another specialist. And it got to the point where I was kind of, uh, it felt like I was chasing my tail. So as soon as I looked back over the year, or at this point, maybe eight months of trying to figure out what was going on, I'd spent thousands of dollars with specialists and blood tests and lab results and all that kind of stuff. And without even thinking about it, money had just been sort of like, you know, hemorrhaging with all of this medical stuff. Seeing medical specialists involves an enormous amount of work. But CrowdMed is sort of this way of getting, leveraging information from the world. So I finally did get my, my uh, report back from CrowdMed and I got this whole series of diagnoses, which was really lovely to see because I saw all the different possibilities. Here I have a foundation now to work from that I didn't have before, so that was really cool. I don't know that anybody now who has any kind of medical problem they're trying to figure out who doesn't take advantage of the internet, right? I mean, we all do it. You know, you have something that's going on, you look it up. And what you find is a really disjointed set of information. What CrowdMed does, I think it compiles all that into something which is sort of succinct and uh, it provides some clarity to all of the noise out there. So that then you can take those pieces that you get and you can start doing your research on that. I am taking antibiotics. Um, I'm pain-free, full functionality. My outlook has, uh, has changed significantly. Because I'm pain-free, I'm not dwelling on this uh, in the same way that I used to. I can look at it a little bit more from a, from a third-person perspective.